I'm only gonna say one thing, subscribe, notification bell, enjoy the video, Duh. What's going on, Team Twitty? I hope you're all super well. Jay, I can barely see a thing out here. Same, it's pretty bright. Bright as. We're off to the town centre. What are you doing, mate? Getting some food, mate. Nice, nice. I'm off to the bank to go and open up my bank account, which I need to do before I go. And then I'm thinking I'm going to have a rest from football training today, mm. right? Just because of my heel. But I do want to get down to the gym. Are you down for that? I'm going to try and get to the gym today. Yeah. You're going to try? Okay. What are you going to try at the gym? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing, first. Of course. So we're going to go run some errands, basically. Pretty much. And yeah, probably catch you at home with something, I don't know, Fortnite? Yeah. Oh yeah, the boys. Well, that didn't work out too well. They wouldn't let me open up a bank again. They, they, they just said that you have the wrong forms and stuff, but I had the right forms, because last time they said, it's all good, we can do it for you. This time, different guy goes, nah. You gotta catch them on the right day, mate. Yeah, it's all part of this journey, though. It's not just football. You have to go open up bank accounts. Like, I love how that that whole thing. It's all part of the journey. It's come from me every time something goes slightly wrong. It's, it's just part of the journey, journey man. Legit. Part of like, you know, you ne sometimes you might need to open up a bank account or find a place to live. These things can be difficult. It's not easy. I've been very lucky with the places I've lived, but if Jay didn't have a spare room in his house, I don't know what I would have done. So there's all these different things. I'm heading home now. Bit of Fortnite. I like that. I like what you just said there. What? In Jay's house. Oh. It's my, my house. Do you own it? It's my house. How much are you making? Hundreds. I'm making bare money. Yeah, sick. So, Fortnite now. Jay has bragged to me about how clean his room is. Let's give it a look. So we walk in. Oh, all the shoes lined up. All the boots. All the boots. The PS. It's looking good, mate. How long did this take you? A couple of hours? Decent. We got Fortnite up. Jay, how are you feeling going into this match? Fantastic. Give us your feelings. Gonna win. W. You're gonna win. You're Ws gonna get. Is this gonna be your first W? I've had a W. What do you mean? The guy blew himself up though. Still won. All right. Well, Jay's probably gonna die soon. I've beaten you already. <laughs> Would you come last round? Seventy second. No, third. I was third. Jay's getting really hyped. He's just camping. He's in the final five. You feeling good? Feeling good? Oh, damn. Okay. We'll, we'll see how this one goes. He came third. He's mad. Oh. Oh, he's mad. Oh, dear. So I'm about to leave the house. <coughs> I'm about to leave the house to go and get some supplies for dinner. But I have a bit of a problem because I'm leaving in six days now and I have to pack all this stuff. I got these which I'm still using, then I've got to put them into that. I got all my clothes that I'm using. I just got a whole lot of stuff. Which makes it difficult because I can't properly pack until like a day or two before and I'm taking some stuff to Australia on the plane because I have 30 kilos and then I'm sending some as well in like a box and then I'm also leaving some stuff here. So I need to sort out all of that. Ugh, it's gonna be difficult because I use like everything every day. Well, maybe not every day. Now two things I need to tell you guys about. The first one being I plan to go to the gym today and Jay isn't going to the gym, which means I can't go because I need like a friend membership sort of thing for a day, which is cool. I was like, yeah, I might just buy my own membership for like a week and see how much it costs. But for three days, it costs you 15 pounds. I was like, well, that's a bit ridiculous. So I think I'm just going to go home after I go to the shops and do my own workout in my room. So that's that. And then secondly, I also received a text message, which I'm quite upset about. It said that there is no training with Crawley Town tomorrow morning. That means that on Thursday will be my last session with Crawley Town in the UK. I might come back next year. There's nothing set in stone, but for this season, it will be the end. And then I go back to Australia on Monday. That's going to be weird, man, to think that I have everything here. Like, I have it all set up. I have my girlfriend, I have Jay, my mate. I'm living in a decent place, I'm enjoying myself. There's no reason for me to be like, oh, I really dislike it, I wanna go home. It's just what's best for me and best for football. So it is what it is. I wanna talk more about that a little bit later. Let's get to the shop. I've come back and I've just looked online for an at-home chest workout. It's basically a guy who does these push-ups, so I'll be following along with him, getting that workout done. If you guys want that workout, it will be in the description. Just click on the link and then follow what he does. I've never actually done it, so it'll be interesting to see how I keep up with him because this guy looks pretty bulked. I'm also going to try and add some dips somewhere in the house if I can think of a place. So let's get to this chest workout. <laughs>
killed me. I like that, and it's only six minutes, like literally so easy to follow along with. You just get it done, and I don't know if you need much more than that, especially if you're just targeting your chest. So it's a bit of adult time looking after myself. We got all the clothes and stuff up there drying, jeans down there as well. Now, massive shout out to Jay, who gave me two toilet rolls. I've literally run out and I don't want to go buy more. It's almost like I refuse to. With six days to go, it's getting close to the end. And what I wanted to speak to you guys about is that it's very difficult to leave a country. The other night I was laying in bed and I was very upset. I wasn't crying, I was just laying in bed upset leaving everything that I have here. I know it's not the end of the world going to Australia. In fact, I'm actually going to enjoy myself. It's just gonna be different. It's going to be a new challenge. And when I come back to England, I hope to become a better player and be in a team where I'm playing for a season because I don't think I can come back here and not play. That would absolutely destroy me. I need to be playing week in, week out. Otherwise my motivation, my love, everything for football will just straight down. Yeah, time for a shower, time to chill. So I've got my dinner and for certain reasons because of someone, I'm eating on the suitcase on my bed. Anything to say? Yeah, cool. <laughs> so this is one of my favorites. We got rice, lamb, broccoli, carrot, smashing this down. I'm super hungry and yeah, let's get to it. Thanks for the seat. Appreciate it. Okay, dinner is done and this is probably the part of the video you guys have been waiting for. I received an email from appremierleague.com. I won't show the full name of the email, but that's them there. This is pretty much how the email reads. We have noticed that you are selling game analysis on your website. The Premier League and or its license are the owners of the match footage that you're using without the authorizations. You are not allowed to copy this match footage for redistribution. The Premier League shares your excitement for football and a desire to inspire others. At least they recognize that. I want to share my knowledge and inspire you guys to learn more about the game through game analysis. Anyway, they say, but we must ask that you remove the match footage of Chelsea football club player N'Golo Kante from your website immediately. So that's fine. There's no more N'Golo Kante analysis on the website anymore, which is fine. There's still an attacking midfielder analysis and a winger analysis for you guys. SheldonTweedy.com is where you'll find that. But they go on to say, we wish you the best with signing professionally. Yours faithfully. Premier League. Like, I think that's so cool that the Premier League actually know who I am. Like, what? Obviously, it's not really going to help me because the Premier League can't sign me. They're not a club. But it's interesting that my efforts are being recognized by people like this. Even though they're putting me in the wrong and telling me to take something down, they're still wishing me all the best. And it's like the support that you guys give me as well is incredible. It's like you all want me to win and I can't thank you enough. And in saying that, the 10K giveaway, I'll be sorting that out tomorrow. So stay tuned for tomorrow's video. But yeah, interesting stuff there from the Premier League. I'm also going to to show you guys a little bit of the training program that I'm building for y'all. I'm not finished it and I'm not super close from finishing it. I still have to do it in segments because I want to organize it into specific sessions. So far, this is it, the football sprint section. You got different positions. So I think that's strikers, wingers, and then you got midfielders, defenders, bit about football sprints, and then we move into passing and shooting, different passing and shooting drills in there that are individual as well as duo. Still an absolute ton of stuff that needs to be done, but I'm loving making it. And for all of you who need clarity on what it actually is, basically you send me in your schedule. If you train Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday with your football team, but let's say you also do cycling on a Monday with your cycling team. Once you buy the program, you send that to me in the email, and then I organize your training schedule with the football sprints with the different types of sessions in there all organized and ready for you to go it's just so effective to have things in front of you like if you can see your whole week and go okay that's what i'm doing there that's what i'm doing there it makes it much easier for you to schedule your week and make sure that you're practicing every part of your game rather than going down and just kicking the ball about for half an hour so that is that i can't wait to bring it to you guys i hope you're all looking forward to it as well but anyway, 10 to 8, I'm signing out. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the day. I'm so much for you. Bye. Listen. Listen.